teaching will be one of the hardest things you'll ever do, but it's also going to be one of the most rewarding. My advice for the first day of school is don't be afraid to ask your students if there's something you're unsure about. They know more about how the school works than most of the teachers put together and you'll find out soon enough that they're always willing to help. I think uh, the biggest thing I would recommend is to, especially during that first week, get to know your kids and let them get to know you a little bit. Um, but not letting them get away with murder from day one. My advice to anyone on their first day of school would be to embrace the imperfections. Um, the first day of school and really any day thereafter um, always has its little challenges and those are really great opportunities for you to reflect and learn for ways that you can improve. My biggest piece of advice to anyone on their first day of teaching school is to write it all down. Um, even if you're not the kind of person that's into journaling, after the first day of teaching, I recommend just go write down all your thoughts about that first day and then save it because on your last day of teaching when you're really sad and you're leaving your kids or whenever you had a bad day and you want to see how far you've come, you can go back and reread it and think of all the funny things that happened the first day that you might have forgotten. My advice for the first day of school would be be prepared. I don't mean that in a Lion King, be prepared for a coup d'etat sort of way, more like a scout motto way. Um, what it means is you need to plan out really thoughtfully the most specific and essential procedures that you want your kids to know on the first day. My advice for the first day of school is to not be too hard on yourself. Treat yourself and your students with a whole lot of patience and care. Some logistical advice, I'd say on the first day of school, make sure that you have a water bottle handy and near you because you're going to get thirsty after doing all that talking and going through rules and procedures and stuff. But don't drink too much because then you might have to go to the bathroom. Just make sure you do it like, or time your water drinking so that you can go to the bathroom during recess or lunch or something. Yeah. And give your students credit as well. They're going to be able to um, roll with it and be flexible. And, and um, I think that working together with them is going to be the most important thing that you're going to learn during the course of the year. Another really important piece of advice, stay calm. Seeing your students as knowledgeable and responsible and sharing your teaching journey with them is such an important part of building a positive classroom. So why not start on day one? And you're probably going to mess up all day long, all day long. I messed up almost every single day on the job for two years, and that's okay. At the end of the day, go to Sarita, go to cafe, click somewhere to unwind, and just relax and realize whatever happened today, you're going to get so much better this year, and those kids are going to love you so much by the time you're done that you're not going to want to leave. Just remember, we're all rooting for you. So you've got this. Have fun. Good luck. Have fun. But good luck on your first day of school. I think you guys will all do awesome. And I can't wait to hear about it. Bye. I hope you have an amazing first day of school. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck and have fun. <laughs>